Grace and peace, we're excited about each day. It's God's gift to you. I want to encourage you to uh, review Bible study, Wednesday's Bible study. Uh, get to know the character. One of the personalities that we're getting to know is uh, Judas for this week. And uh, we think he got a bad rap. And we'll be uh, interested in, in your opinion of the same Sunday. Fifth Sunday is family, intergenerational Sunday. So we encourage families to come together. Get those kids up and invite them. If you have to cook dinner for them, do what you need to do. But uh, on Sunday, uh, come and worship together as family, as we are sharing and growing together. First Sunday of May, we will relax uh, the mass requirements. I won't be required, but strongly encouraged. Uh, and do what you do, want to do that will be comfortable to you. And that will be on the first Sunday of May. Uh, fifth Sunday, Intergenerational Sunday, worshiping together as family. Our youth minister, our brother Armstrong, will be uh, preaching, and we're excited about that in our time of sharing. I need your prayers. We are preparing and seeking to find ways. Uh, I've read an alarming statistic that over 21,000 people a day, mainly children, die of hunger. 21,000 a day, mainly children. Uh, we're going to partner with Lot Carey. Baptist Foreign and Global Mission Convention, a Kids Against Hunger uh, ministry that we have. Friendship, family, I want us to stretch, and we're going to do it, uh, to seek to provide at least 100,000 meals, yes, 100,000 meals per year to our global partners and our partners in these United States as we can. And you'll hear more about that, but begin to pray now for God to use us and to prepare us. It's unfathomable that in this world that 21,000 persons die every day of hunger, of hunger. Wow. We're going to try to make a dent in that as we work and as we share together. Remember Fifth Sunday, family gathering. Remember First Sunday, relaxing of mask. Also community table, First Sunday. Our Kids Against Hunger in our partnership with Lot Carey, and you. You are God's gift to you. Enjoy your gift, nurture your gift, work and pray together. And again, uh, try that Bible study and look at Judas hopefully from a different perspective of getting a bad rap. Peace of the Lord be with you. Take care of your health. This is Pastor Jones. Peace. Oh,